Hey, what's up everybody? Super Milwaukee Boy back at you in the kitchen with another In My Kitchen food review. Uh, today's product, I'm doing the Smucker's Peanut Butter, the creamy version. Now they did have the chunky version, in which I do like chunky peanut butter, and maybe if you guys request it, I'll uh, do that one next. I go with the creamy because I don't think it would be much of a difference in the review rating. Reviewing the two, the other one's just uh, has actual peanuts in it, and this one is made from ground peanuts, actual ground peanuts, in which, guys, I think it's both about the same, as long as, you know, the brand, that's the main thing. Uh, this one, I suppose, as from the last peanut butter review I did, and I believe the last one was the Reese's peanut butter. I think this one's going to be better and why do I think that is because this one like people were saying in the comments actually has the oil on the top and from what I read in the comments someone told me that if the oil is on the top it is made from real peanut oil and not processed oil like your palm oils or your uh, vegetable oils. So without further ado guys. I want to really quick read you a few nutrition facts that you might be interested in. Uh, serving size is 2 tablespoons, 32 grams. Calories is 190. Total fat, 16 grams. Saturated fat, 3 grams. Sodium is 110 milligrams. Carbs is 7 grams. And protein is 8 grams. The, sh the fiber is 3 grams, which is good. I think everybody should get a good amount of fiber in their diet. And without further ado, guys, let's open this up. I brought a little tool to use. Got to always be careful around sharp tools like knives. There we go, fresh, fresh peanut butter. Just took the plastic off. And before I open this sucker up, my rating skill as usual. One, meaning the product is awful. Two, meaning the product was okay. 3 mean the product was good, but they can always step it up and improve the product. 4 mean the product was great. And 5 mean the product was fantastic. Here we go, guys. Oh, well, that's very oily. I want you guys to really quick, if I can, take a look at a lot of this oil that's in this one. Now, that's the real peanut oil as what I was told from the people in the comment section is that when you get that peanut oil that's when you know you got good peanut butter so let's dig in guys let me get a spoonful it's hard even to get through some of this oil I might even have to dump some of this oil out because they there's so much peanut oil in this guys but look at that it's so oily but they say that's the best peanut butter. It's dripping off the spoon, guys. So, here we go. That's my spoonful, guys, right there. Mm. Now, this is a more, for me, with the oil in it, the Smuckers is a more stick to your mouth kind of peanut butter, but it's not as dry as say the Reese's peanut butter that I've done maybe a few years ago. But in total, do I like this better than the Reese's peanut butter? Absolutely. It is, um, I believe in my mind with the oils on top, the all natural peanut oil, I would say this is real peanut butter guys, this is the legit stuff right here. So on my rating scale in conclusion, I would give nat uh, Smucker's natural peanut butter, the creamy version, a 5 for fantastic guys. It's really good peanut butter, I can't put anything past that. Uh, it was good in taste, 
the texture, if you're a fan of that kind of oily peanut butter, in which I am, you're going to enjoy it. If you're not, you might think differently. You might stick to Jif or Skippy or one of these other brands of peanut butter. Let me know in the comments section below what else you guys want to see. Thank you for joining me in the kitchen again. As always, guys, I got mad love for you. And I'll see you guys on the next one.